as I think is well known, uh, Lord Goldsmith did come to visit us in Washington uh, in February uh, of 2003 uh, to discuss what our legal view was of the use of force against Iraq, but he did not disclose to us what his own view was or what the view uh, of others uh, were inside the British government. I think you have to separate the policy from the law, and I think one could debate whether the Iraq war was a good policy and whether it was a good policy to go to war without a new Security Council resolution. But the narrow question is, was there a legal basis under existing resolutions? And I think the answer to that is yes. Remember, the United States, the United Kingdom, and France had been using force against Iraq for 10 years throughout the 1990s. So either all of that use of force was illegal, and so the question is not just the Iraq war in 2003, but all of that use of force, uh, or there was uh, authority. For, it would not have been for me to be stiffening the backbone of uh, the Attorney General of Great Britain, and I don't recall that at all. Uh, uh, and furthermore, we didn't know what his view was. Uh, he came and asked us what our view was. Uh, and we explained, and I don't think any of the lawyers in the administration, either Will Taft, who was the legal advisor at the State Department, and my great friend or myself, were we were certainly not hawks on, the, on Iraq, uh, but just on the narrow legal question of was there authority, uh, we explained that this was uh, our legal position and had been the position of the Clinton administration.